how did I get into rendering and 3D modeling? Um, how did I? I've always wanted to do it, to be honest. I've wanted to do it for so long, and I didn't do it. I kept wanting and wanting and wanting, and then finally, I think I got a 3D printer, and when I realized how awesome 3D printers are, I was like, I want to learn this stuff. I really want to learn it, and I want to model things. I want to solve problems, and so after getting a 3D printer, I was like, really motivated to learn how to 3d model because i found so many uses for it like i'm like oh i can 3d print i can 3d print like a cover for this and design it perfectly how i need it to be is that a, my real room with those jojos or is it a green screen it's a green screen but it's also my real room <laughs> i'll show you hold on so this is the green screen oh let me turn this off so this is the green screen and then this is my real room <laughs> so, it is a green screen, but it's also my real room. Did it take... Wait. Uh, did it take you long to learn how to... Uh, like, 3D model and render? So, rendering, um, I've been messing around with in my spare time. So, I, I... I learned from just messing around in Blender and stuff. As for 3D modeling, um... Learning it was like, I started off super simple, so some of the first things I 3D modeled were really small things, like I 3D modeled a, like, a piece, like a square brick in order to, like, basically hold up my camera, um, because my camera kept, like, tilting downwards, so I, I 3D printed a square brick just to hold it up, very simple, and then eventually I just kept, I just, uh, I just kept adding a little more and complexities to my 3d prints until i or to my 3d models until i 3d modeled these cat ear speakers that go on top of your monitors and then i 3d modeled like i just 3d model everything yeah yeah so this is my 3d printer behind me i want to paint it white and then i want to put it up here behind me on that thingy where my printer is um but so i learning blender so using a cad i used tinkercad at first uh, using Tinkercad, um, I think it's really awesome because it's super simple and you just do super simple things, but when things are simple and you're able to do them, I think it motivates you more. When you do projects that are too hard, you get too overwhelmed and you just quit. So, like, I think simple is best. Just start absolutely as simple as possible and then slowly build up. But yeah, if you do a project where you're like, I want to create, I don't know, like a giant mold over the top of this, like... It, like an overwhelming project will just make it to where you might fail like the likelihood of you failing is higher and then if you fail then you stop liking the hobby at least in my experience so i was trying to be like okay my first 3d prints is square my second 3d prints is square with little arms and like you know and then you just slowly build up uh 3d or blender took me i was messing around in blender but uh this month or this month, uh, this year in March, I spent every day of the month practicing 3D Blender until I got way better at it. So I 3D modeled these cute little Shiba. So they're they're to charge my phone. So they're like you put a wireless charger inside, and then I put my phone on top, and then it like looks like it's holding my phone, but it's a phone a wireless phone charger. So I 3D printed one that looks like my dog, and then one that looks like Beans. So I did Beans and Hero, and then. They basically open up. I put a terabyte on there because since I made it, I was like, might as well. This is the inside and then I just, it just is simple. Like this is just, it's just simple. It closes, you put the wireless charger through here. The cord will go through there and you just set it on your desk. And then you can charge your phone. Ta -da! But yeah, start as simple as possible because I think when you are, for me personally, what I can successfully make something then it's just like yes you get so motivated and that motivation just keeps you going but anytime i do a project that's too overwhelming i just quit i'll get way overwhelmed i'll get stressed and i'm like i'm done but yeah i do want to do i do want to render more characters in my room i'd love it i'd love it so much it's so much fun